Okay, I looked into where all of the... Hello. All of the things are now, so now we don't have to look for them. And it's so sad. Like I said in the previous episode, there was, um... They were really obvious. Well, let's do some quests for them. For these monsters that we need. Let's try and find an event quest for the missing... <coughs> not for the monster that I need. Of course, I'm not going to find them, am I? I suppose I do need to find them in the correct area. I would have thought there'd be more Zinnagor quests than this, but oh well. It was Zinnagor and... Uh, what was There's the other no thing? So Carry off. Take your time. Never do today what you can do tomorrow. Is what Hinoa always says. It's time to beat a Zinnagor. I promise I actually don't actually know how difficult they are classed. Okay, so I guess we beat a Rajang and a Zinnagor. Shouldn't be a problem. Okay, I love my... Uh, when monsters keep destroying my carts and my livelihood. Said no trade ever. First a Lagombi, then a Diablos, then two Volvodon, and now a Rajang and Zinnagor. I just wanted to get there, uh, just for once, want to get from point A to point B without getting beat up by monsters. Rajang! A certified Rajang moment. So yeah, these two were actually really, it was really sad. Like, one of them was just behind the second camp. And the other one was... I ran past it, like, three times. It also seems that the ones in Shrine Ruins, like, I actually saw two of them and just completely fucking ignored them. I just didn't see them. Because I did go to where they were. I just didn't see the... see the sword. Let's go, lads. So yeah, we'll get the two we'll get the two things and then we'll destroy these monsters, especially the feet of the Zinnagor. Let's make this a quick one. So the first one, which we missed, was really obvious and it was right here. We ran through this tunnel three times and we didn't see that if you keep to the left hand side of it. There's a fucking tunnel here. Even though I said there was a secret passageway in this tunnel. I just never fucking went into it. And then the other one... Is just behind this camp, which is a bit more obvious why I missed it, but still. Like, it's not very that difficult. So yeah, like, they were both really obvious, like I said they would be. <laughs> we don't even need the defense increase or attack increase, but we're gonna do it anyway. Because why the fuck not? <laughs> we can make this monkey fight him. We could be like Among Us, and then they'll fight among themselves. Because they'll be like, that's pretty sussy. Oh shit, I didn't get my thing. Oh, it's gonna go... Is Rajang below? Fuck. Oh well. There you are. Thanks, buddy. Fuck, you interrupted my attack. I'm
have to break both feet for a 90% chance. If we don't break both, we get 70% if we only break one. Which is still good. Why, hello there. Hmm. Fancy meeting you here. Oh nice, both broken. <laughs> Ballista Binder! <laughs> Wait, Ballista Binder is actually from this game. No, it's from a it's from a monster to game, but not this one specifically. Look at this monkey! I'll be gentle, mm. promise. This monkey's been lazy, isn't he? He has not been lazy. Oh fuck, we missed. <laughs> Well, too late, he died. Hmm. You won't be needing this. <laughs> well, Basil, he's coming to ambush me. But it's not really much of an ambush when he yeah. yells that he's come in. Because if I hadn't heard that yell across the zone, I wouldn't have even known there was a battle beast here. Because I'm that fucking blind. Okay, he's above us. But yeah, we got the difficult to find um, ones, we just didn't get the obvious ones. And Shrine Ruins, there was a cave that I didn't find.
Cioè, mm. Io was gonna slip. Mm. Going after it. Careful you don't be slipping. Why was I even fighting him? Run. Just a quick polish. Not gonna actually need the Rajung part anyway. We're only here for the Whetstone time. For the Zinagor. That even damages me? I'm not even dented! Oh, I am actually, my- That actually got rid of all my fucking bats. I was dented. A little bit. But barely a dent, moving right along. Knocked me into the stratosphere. Do you actually think you can take me? Don't forget me. Think you could. Think you can be bullshit? Because that's pretty bullshit. Have a little nap. Mm. It's mentally sharpening time. Your tail is broke, meaning your power is gone. You have no longer got the power to. Channel Fortnite. Wait, you can break the hand? I did not know you could actually break Rajan hands. That's something I've never done in any game. I thought the hands just soaked damage for the face. Damn, I moved the clock. I put my meat in my mouth.
Look at that monkey. <laughs> Basuki saw me kill the monkey and was like, shit, gotta go. Look at that monkey. <laughs> we got the claw that we need, dude. No, we just need to get that Moe Fang. Guess we'll do the ice area next, but I don't really want him. But we need to get the ice fang, so. I want to finish off the Shrine Ruin, though. Shit. Until next time. So maybe we could check where we can get more Xenogor Claws. Like, what do we actually need for the thing? Oh, wait, we didn't actually need to go upstairs. We just looked at the wishlist. Um, I don't know if we... No, we don't actually need another Destroyer. It's Tenderized that we need. I need to do a quick hunt. Like, we don't really need another tenderizer. <sighs> so what monster do we need to hunt then? I got everything you need. Just tell me what you need. We could just hunt a Magdamalo and try and make Magdamalo weapon. Yeah, because if I'd have to hunt low rank Magdamalo, I don't really want to do that. Well, if I hunt a low rank Magdamalo, it would be even more easier to kill than the regular one. Can we just craft it from scratch? Nope. Powerful equipment is important, but you want to look good in battle too, right? Sometimes it's hard to choose. See you again soon. Fuck okay, it, we'll hunt whatever Magdamalo there is. Whether Magdamalo is required for the part. Yeah, we even got small and big Magdamalo. Alright, Magdamalo Shell, Agamalo Scrout. Yep, just have to hunt low rank. This should take no time whatsoever then. How can I help you? Event quest, low rank Magdamalo! Actually, is there, but annoyingly, none of the um, it's not in the forest. We could all just do le like one of these quests. Wait, deliver rings. <laughs> Gotta hoard fast. How the fuck do you get rings? Oh, I actually really love this one. Like this, this one gives you the Akami skin for your Palamu. Alright, we'll do one of the event quests instead. I've never actually done the Sonic one, so I'll try to do the Sonic one. Oh no! Cringe! Looks like Sanic has dropped all his rings! If you help us collect them all, I'll set you up with some materials for layered armor that will make you look just like us. And there's an extra reward if you do it really fast. Oh shit, there's, a actual, there's an extra reward for doing it fast as fuck, boy. Well, I'm not going to get that extra reward, so maybe I shouldn't do that. Hello. I'm not going to do it fast, so I might as well do the Akami one instead. I can't remember how... You... I don't think I ever actually did the Akami quest, but I was really happy that it existed. I've got a special quest for, for Akami for you. Collect the cargo 
you in around the shrine ruins, and I'll give you materials to create a layered armor that will make your Palamute look like the legendary sun goddess. See you later then. Honestly, might actually use that for a bit, because like if it's a layered armor, I might actually use that. Because that's pretty cool. I thought it was an actual armor set. We don't need to eat. Okay, so there are... I honestly should. I honestly should do a playthrough of Akami. Cause it's such a fun and interactive game. Well, not really interactive. Certainly not doing the fishing mini game again though. That was a pain in the ass. <laughs> ah. Are there exactly twenty, twenty-one, or can I miss a few? The problem is, I don't know what they actually look like, either. Oh, they're the, they're the Dudongo boxes. A picture of a Matsu, drawn by a tiny eyes. Amaterasu, that's what it is, not a Matsu. Yoinky face. So yeah, one of them, we literally looked right at it and we just didn't see it. Because one of them was over here. Like on that tree. And we just didn't see it. Because I have no fucking eyes. So yeah, it turned out that it's on this branch down here, like, you just can't fucking see it. Look, like, if you step on the branch, you can see it. Like, you just couldn't see it, though, unless you, like, actually stepped onto the branch. So we looked right at it and just didn't fucking see. And then there was another one which, like, I believe we probably saw, but never actually picked up. There is a possibility we never actually went on this ledge as well, but I feel that we did. Maybe one. Maybe we didn't go on it then. Yeah, I guess we must have missed this ledge then. So we didn't miss this one. Maybe we did. Like, there's something on this ledge. I think it's about here. Yeah, this platform here. Like, I think we just never went on this one. Because it was the uh, thing to the river than I thought it was. And there's a cave. There we are. There's a cave. There's a cave which we missed. The music is so hype, though. Guess it's up the mountain. Um, where's the last one then? Give me a sec to just find the last one. Okay, I thought I... Oh yeah. I think it was in a cave again. Like, I think it was a cave light over here somewhere. 
No, just on this ledge here. Looks like we do have to get every single one of them. Missed one. Scratch eye, fuck's sake, of course I get caught stuck on a fucking plant while doing that. Oh god, we actually don't have that we don't actually don't have infinite time. I didn't notice that. Like the time limit's actually shorter than it usually is. Kind of ironic that you do this at night, considering that Amaterasu is a sun god. Come on. Let's go. You get to soon turn yourself into a god among men. And since this quest is so short, I can probably do like the. Hold on. I can do the um, Barry off as well. I didn't pay attention to the last quest where we actually got any progress. I don't think we'll make any progress doing these low rank quests towards actually progressing the story. But they're fun and interactive. Yeah, they're just fun and interactive. They don't actually make any progress. Oh wait, I didn't pay attention to what the fuck I got as the rewards. Everything you need. Good luck out there. Hello. Forge layered armor. Uh, they all cost fucking tickets. Kind of bullshit. The cat ones also fucking cost tickets. Like the palamutes and their ones cost tickets. Oh, special. Ah, oh, shit, we didn't get enough. What? Why do we need two different parts? 
We have to do the quest multiple times. That's annoying. It says low rank, yet they have high rank parts. I want to craft that though. I hope we don't have to get eight of them because that'll be annoying. Can we make a weapon as well? Or does he just come with a weapon? I guess it just comes with a weapon, probably. fuck's sake. Fine, I guess we'll do it again and hope that we don't have to hope that we don't need eight of them. It doesn't take very long to do, so when you go to the hub swiggity swooty come on, get the archery and tattoo. Yeah, bingo! Card key opened the door! <laughs> We got the statue of the Archfiend Jaraxxus. Yeah. Oh my, what's You're this? Welcome. My correction, enough note to gather the message. Well, if you don't mind. Ooh, hoo, hoo. Well, now I see, um, a guard, such a thing to come to pass. Yes, I was in lightning read indeed. As thanks, I will present you with these especially exclusive articles, one not usually available at my store. Take care. I forgot to read them as well, actually. We can now read them because we have them all. The waters in the land is pure, clean water, and rich as the soil. For few, uh, from rich soil sprouts new life. Prayers bring water. The land was home to many gods, but they shunned the people. Thus, the land was only admired with envy from afar. Then, without warning, a bolt of lightning res uh, resounded throughout the night. When dawn broke, the gods were gone. The people began to gather in this blessed land, enriched many, erad erad in many shrines to venerate their departed gods. Graced by their absence, the people lived in beautiful and peaceful life, filling the land with prayers. Moons passed, times changed, the people became arrogant and thankless, as did so, the land fell into desolation. Then one night, a gale swept the lands before halting abruptly, as though of, uh, it were a breath of divine being. In the wake of the appearance of the gods, thought to have vanished, terrified the people. They fled from the ire. The people begged for the uh, clemency, but the deities raged regardless, chasing the mortals away. Time devoured the peoples, the shrines and the prayers, but eventually the pure water and rich soil returned to new nurture new life. As someone like pointed out, like that's just the this is the story of Nawa and Abushi. They destroyed the shrine ruins, that's the reason it's ruins. Oh wait, I forgot the rampage. Oh fuck, I forgot the rampage messages. I think all the maps have an extra um, sword that I've been forgetting to pick up. Oh no, you get I think you get the rampage messages from There's a possibility there's 11 rampage there's a that there's rampage ones in all the maps. Or you get the rampage ones from uh, getting the previous ones. Now I think you get the rampage ones from getting the other ones. That like every 5 in the other ones gives you one rampage. All right, long ago the felines came to the flooded forest seeking the great fish of lore, but he was tailed by a meddlesome melanx. When the feline wasn't looking, the melanx snatched the bags, leaving him with nothing but a single piece of meat. Defeated, the feline collapsed in frustration when he realised there was a hungry snake right under his nose. The feline tore off some meat, 
for the snake, and it hissed happily, feed the stream, and I will feed you. Confused, the feline never left through last mortals into the stream. Then suddenly, thousands of fish appeared. It was not the mythic creature uh, he'd sought, but he was delighted anyway and filled his pockets to the brim. The greedy melanx seeing this said to itself, I'll throw in a bunch, I'll get even more fish back for myself. He gathered a heap of meat and tossed it all in, only to be greeted by the uh, gaping maw of the legendary giant fish. The melanx took one look at the monster and fled for its life, dropping the melanx's belongings in the process. And so, having seen the fabled fish, the feline thanked its serpentine friend and set off in search for a new adventure. Oh, the shelves are full. Oh yeah, I forgot they're made of wood. It's the Archfiend statue! Look at this monkey. Vibing. Okay, let's get our power. Maybe if we go fast, we'll get it, we'll get more. Similar to how like the previous one said that. Let's make this a quick one. Hoping that it lasts. Oh no, nope. it did not. I was hoping it would last longer if I held it down. Yeah, this is the right path. Like, we go this way, loop round, and then go up the hill. Did we miss one? Nope. Oh, the path goes this way. Oh, no. No, I was going to say we missed one, but we didn't. Sweet. 
It looks like that one's down below, but it isn't. <laughs> So let's hope that we don't have to get eight. Because <laughs> we only got two scrolls. Maybe if we get it done in sub three minutes, then it gives us more. But it doesn't say anything about being faster. Yaha! Hello there, I got a ticket for you. Here, have it. Hello? Is there anyone there? I got everything you need. Can we just craft the layered armor? Yes. We do not be able to craft the special layered armor though. We can make our cat armors though. Cat games! Good luck out there. Come on, please be the entire set. Don't make me have to do this quest twice more. What the dog doing? becomes a god among men. <laughs> totally worth it. Well, that is that.